Well, welcome back to Great Day St. Louis. I'm just getting my own benefit out of our next guest here. Investing in a home is a huge decision, especially if you're a first-time home buyer. I remember the butterflies. Deanna Doherty, the president of American Equity Mortgage, is here to help you out in specific. But we'll try to talk broadly to everybody. Welcome back to you. Thank you. Thank you. I cannot imagine that it is not the right time for first-time home buyers right now. It is such a fabulous time. I mean, the interest rates are so low. The housing values are down, so you can get great deals. You can buy a lot more house right now than what you could in other markets. So it's a very exciting time. The, the tricky part of the real estate market right now is selling. Because a lot of, you know, yes. again, you might yes. be selling a home that you bought even 10 years ago for less than you paid. 10 years ago. But if you're in the position of a first time home buyer, you got nothing to sell. So you're just, you're sort of reaping the benefits of this fire sale that's right. going on right now. And one of the things for first time home buyers, you know, many of them are renting. And instead of paying that money for rent every month, you could be investing it in a home and actually building equity, which builds for your future. So you're talking to renters now suddenly, people yes. who have a residence, but they don't own it. I mean, you're looking at a payment that's probably comparable to what you're paying in rent anyway, right? Exactly. And that's why it's just such a fabulous time for them, especially, sure. to buy a home. So this is what you do day in and day out. What's the best advice you could give to new home buyers, people looking for that first piece of property? Get pre-approved so mm -hmm. that you, you know how much you can afford to buy and you have realistic expectations. Um, it also gives you some leverage in negotiating because you already have your approval on your loan. Uh, work with a good realtor, and then think about things like uh, you, you may need money after you purchase the house for window treatments sure. or buy some furniture. So those types of things you need to account for also, but don't go take out credit and buy those things prior to getting your mortgage because it can affect your ability to get the mortgage. And that's a mistake Ooh, yeah. a lot of first-time home buyers make also. So if you rack up credit card debt buying the new dinette set and the yes. couch, that's going to look poorly on yes. your mortgage application. Oh, exactly, because it changes your credit profile. Right. So now all of a sudden you have some additional debt that you yeah. didn't have before. So you just need to be cognizant of that. You mentioned finding a good realtor. Isn't that half the battle? Do you have any tips in that department? Referrals, is that a good way to go? Referrals is the best. Yeah. Um, you know, uh, your, your friends and, and other people that you talk to that you trust, that have had good experience, you know, talk to them, find out who they use, look at how much time the realtor has been in the business and how many homes they've sold, what kind of market and, and area do they sell homes in, but definitely a referral would be my advice. You talked about those added expenses of, of furnishing window treatments. What mm -hmm. about things uh, that, are, that are going to impact you down the road other than just the cost of the property, like uh, uh, insurance, like property taxes? <laughs> yeah. Right, right. Yeah, you'll have property taxes and homeowners insurance, yeah. which will be figured into your mortgage payment when you get your pre-approval. But it's different if you've been renting or maybe living with mom and dad. Um, you'll have maintenance and repairs that you'll have to do. So if you're a renter, it, there's no one to call, right. you know, to, right. to unclog the drain uh -huh. other than a plumber, and you're going to pay for that. Um, so you have to think about those things, utilities that m maybe are, are going to be different because the size of the home is larger sure. than where you currently are. So there's other expenses. But it's just such a great investment, and to own your own home, is, yeah. there's nothing like it. Don't let it pass you by. That's great right. time to buy, tough time to sell. So maybe even that uh, condo at the lake, a little second place somewhere, maybe. I'm just throwing it out Absolutely. there. Absolutely. Deanna, thank you very much. To contact Thanks. American Equity Mortgage, you can give them a call, 314-878-9999, or you can click online at AmericanEquity.com. Have a good day. Thanks, you too. Not bad. Kent, Virginia? All right, still to come, we are talking with comedian Greg Warren this morning. Yes. Greg's over there, ready to go. And he's a Just St. Louis. Say something then. funny, Greg. Be funny. <laughs> oh, my. Nice. He's been making us laugh for years, but now he's hitting the late night talk show circuit big time. All right. Plus, we've been laughing at this all morning. <laughs> And we just want to laugh some more. <laughs> That's Matt Chambers. It is I know Matt it doesn't Chambers. look like it, but it is. And it's an actual photo taken of Matt back in the <laughs> 1980s when he, when he had facial hair. <laughs> now, coming up, we're going to show you the phone application that allows you to take a trip back in time, which may or may not be a good thing.